what I want to talk to you about might seem strange because it seems like there's not a ton to be optimistic about. Um, I grant that. Uh, but we're going to zoom out a little bit and see how things, especially how many of you have been uh, atheists aware of the atheist movement in some way or another for like 10 years or more? A lot of people. So you may have seen some of these changes that I want to talk about. I'll just give you a really brief summary of where I'm coming from on all this. I became an atheist when I was a teenager. That's like mid 1990s. Uh, in terms of internet age. And in my case, it was starting to ask a lot of questions, realizing that I could go online and try to search for those answers in my own privacy, waiting until like my parents went to bed so I could use AOL dial up late at night. Um, and there was no, I don't think there was Google. I don't think there were a lot of good ways to search, which meant everything you found if you were questioning religion, I did not know the word atheism, you just found like shady websites written by dudes clearly living in a basement somewhere. For a while I thought that I'd missed my shot And by the time I turned 25 Everybody would have forgot About me and my story My songs and who I am I'd fade into obscurity Another guitar playing white man I used to stand at the kitchen table to see the Rolling Stone cover stars who just turned 21, six or seven Grammys in their arms. And that world seems so far from me, graduating college at 23, while they're off living their dreams. They must be so happy. Mm -hmm. 